So instead of getting a Dymo 4XL, you can get the smaller label printer for $80 at Walmart or even less on OfferUp or eBay. And it prints USPS approved shipping labels, just smaller. Please don't be ugly. Please don't be ugly. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Please. <gasps> oh my god! I see a bunch of people posting all these business checks. I want to see the custom orders. People don't typically understand why custom orders are so expensive. So I wanted to start a trend to show the world all the love that actually goes into making a custom order. Small business owners, who's with me? I see a bunch of people posting all these business checks. I want to see the custom orders. People don't typically understand why custom orders are so expensive. So I wanted to start a trend to show the world all the love that actually goes into making Today I went to the mall and I was stocking up on our gold tissue paper, but then I saw orange and I was like, oh my gosh, I gotta get orange because orange is my second favorite color. But then I got it home and I was like, mm, orange doesn't really look that good. So then I had this bright idea that orange means a free pair of shades. Yes, I repeat, if you open up that box and you see orange tissue, that means there's a free pair of shades inside. I added these pair, this, these pair I added this pair, the edgy shades. And then I tried to do that clicking transition, but yeah, didn't really work that well. I'm still trying and then I write her a note and I'm like, hey, Hey girl, it's your lucky day because there's a free pair of shades in there just to say extra thanks for your love and support. And as always, I'm grateful and I'm thankful and this is all wrapped with so much love. Thanks TikTok fams. Okay, so thanks to you guys, I've been getting a lot more orders and I need help. So I decided to recruit this beautiful man here and just put him up to the test and see if he can do what 
I require him to do as a member of the So Extra team. Um, is his packaging skills up to scratch? I don't know, but you guys will be the judge. So let me know if you think his packaging skills are up to scratch. I don't know about this tucking in part. I don't think he knew that we have stickers <laughs> to like seal it all up. But as long as he puts some love in it, and he does, here we go. All right, business owners, show us where your packaging stuff is from. Let's help people out. Some people are starting off the way we were starting off at one point. So let's show them in the right direction. Show them where you get your packaging stuff from and show some love. So as you guys know, I'm in the process of trying to set up a little business where I sell these hand-painted pots that I made. And today the first package arrived with the pots in it. I've only ordered six pots, so that's either going to be enough to do three sets of two or two sets of three, depending on what you guys want. This is just because I wanted to test out the pots from this supplier and the different materials and stuff, so I might switch up a little bit. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. I did these ones in a different colour to the last set, but I think they're still just as cute. Hopefully these will be available very, very soon to buy if you guys are interested. But yeah, thanks for watching. Let's pack another order together. So first I get her box. She ordered the Lauren pin tank, the Rachel face mask, Belle's mini top, and Belle's boxer short. I roll the tank up, put everything in the box, add some stickers, and it's ready. Please don't be ugly. Please don't be ugly. Please. Please. Oh my god! I have my own business check. This is my most popular product. This is my favorite product. This is one of my most expensive products. This is my most affordable product. Here's my favourite TikTok ideas for small businesses. Behind the scenes, where you get your packaging from, your favourite product and why. Packaging and order, shipping and order.
Tips for promoting your business on social media part two. Consistency is key. I know it's hard, but it's very important to stay consistent. Things don't happen overnight. They take time. Your business growing is going to take time. So make sure you're posting every day. Trust me, I'm a stay-at-home mom. I know it's hard. Keep pushing. Hey guys, it's Aurora from West Main. Let's pack Peyton's order. She got a ton of cute items, so we're gonna need a box for this one. So first I build the box and add two pieces of tissue paper to line the box. She got our Friday tea, our It's That Simple tea, Call Me Coral bodysuit, and two of our Brahmies. And this super cute tweed skirt. It was the last one and these super cute earrings. I wrapped them up in some tissue paper and put them in the box. So I just created these cute little butterfly stickers. I'm wondering if I should add them in every order. And that's all. Thanks for watching. Tips for starting a small business part one. So when I first started out, I started with these mailers. These are from You Pack and Ship. I found them on Amazon, but if you go straight to their website, youpackandship.com, they have great quality products and super, super cheap. Then I went ahead and I upgraded to add into my mailers these boxes because I do send earrings, so I want them to be a little bit more protected. But in the beginning when I couldn't, I would just buy those little boxes from Walmart and stick them in there and send them out until i got more money you know to be able to upgrade so make sure that you are not overspending on your packaging because yes it's important but you also don't want to waste all your money on packaging and then not have good products here's the day in my small business black socks with tan slippers and all so i'm printing all the labels it's a dime of forks all i got her on amazon there's literally all the headband orders that are going out today so these are the buttons that are going on the button headbands because they're being made for nurses so that it takes the pressure off of their ears so we stick that button in there and then we just kind of stitch 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 and then these are the satin tags that go into the headbands so now we're just kind of packaging it up and making sure the whole deal is good to go so we fold her again and a few times um but then we stick my little tag on there it's really fun and cute and then there's my custom tissue paper so i just keep folding and then i roll her up like a burrito so it's not as yummy as chipotle but i promise you it's just as cute so let me put on the little postcard you know expecting me snap and we are done i see a bunch of people posting all these business checks i want to see the custom orders people don't typically understand why custom orders are so expensive so i wanted to start a trend to show the world all the love that actually goes into making a custom order small business owners Who's with me?